Start the recording while we're at it. So this is recorded for posterity's sake, or something. Oh dear. So in case they need evidence. Something like that. Entertainment, I think, is more the mode. The question is, who are you entertaining with it? Thank <laughs> you. Whoever's willing to pay? <laughs> Okay, that's a dangerous subject on that one. <laughs> <laughs> All So, this, this morning's episode, we are going wreck diving. What is that? Shipwreck scan, uh, shipwrecks have been scattered about the universe, so we can now go play with them, only they're all trip mined. Oh, and they have ah. pirates uh, monitoring them, so if you land, they want to come shoot you. They're NPCs as opposed to assholes. Do you get the scavenged stuff from the ships? Yep. yep. Not parts from the ships yet, but armor, stuff like that. Loot, yeah, loot crates, weapons. Loot boxes. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. No, what? Oh, that... Uh, oh, good God. <laughs> it's probably not quant, though. I don't care. It's just principle the principle of the matter. Here. Yeah, it might be something like a Grecium or something. What we're whining about is the fact that all those rocks just showed up at once the minute we cut, just broke Atmo. Oh, look, there's a second patch. Fucking huge-ass patch. Uh, that could represent a lot of money from the mining aspects. Oh. Which we still did pretty good yesterday, even though we had that little issue in the evening. Uh, yeah. But it might be worth it taking, you know, if you're solo mining, taking a prospector out here, because those are probably... Um, yeah, prosy-sized rocks. Prosy rocks, yeah. So, uh, bus driver, where are we going? We're going to Arcourt Mining Area 48. Get our our IP. And I have to look at the. Once we get there, I'll look at the heading that we have to take. Fuel and repair here. Uh, he already dented the bird. Did I miss something? No. It, <laughs> other than the fact that it's it's down hydrogen, the even when we started, not a whole lot. Only maybe 10 15 percent. I'm just being a smart ass. Yes, <laughs> I know. I'm just following along to have fun. <laughs> you said you. You know, waxed and polished the bird, but you didn't bother to put gas on it. I spent all the money on the polish and the wax. What do you want? <laughs> Wait, have you seen what inflation is these days? <laughs> like that. I figured I'd make the current fuel last by making it smoother. Well, yeah, I mean, there's so much friction in outer space. <laughs> yeah. Is 
that right now I've got images of sort of space, the scene of space balls. Only put 10 bucks in it. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna refuel. Click on that. So Jess, after uh, after you landed last time, how much time before they the bad guys showed up? Um, it was a fair fair while because I mean, it was, since it was a cat, it was a pretty big wreck. I had to figure out, you know, figure out how to navigate in the in the wreckage. So, um, so was, did you just hear the boom, or did you suddenly see the ships fly over? Um, I was heading back to the ship and so suddenly fire started coming in on the ships and I looked up and there was the, the Cuddy and the Buccaneer shooting scatter guns at the ship. Let's see, we need to go on a heading of 171 for 25 clicks. Oh, other way. One. So I haven't posted the dates yet, but we do have a mark. Um, February seventeenth is the start of the next free fly. I'll post it all up. Uh, what's likely to happen? The way this kind of works is you create your account whenever you want, uh, but the day the free fly starts, if you don't already own a package or own the game, you know, basically have bought into the game, they'll give you a code, or there'll be a code posted on the website that you'll apply to your account. And that will let you in for X amount of time. It'll for the actually the duration of the event, basically. And then your oh, account okay. will get a whole bunch of ships based on whatever they're giving out at the time. Okay, so let me let me let me play a question back. So can you create an account and get the game downloaded and installed without having purchased a package? That's a fair question. I don't remember because the last time I did it was when I first did this, it was the free fly for IAE, but I don't remember applying a code to my account at the time, so that's where it gets weird. Won't hurt to try if well, you create your account, but. Well, and again, I mean, I'm, I'm fine. It is more of, you know, because I've, I've read the pieces that talk about, you know, make sure you put the referral code in here when you create the account because you can only do it there, et cetera, et cetera. And then it talks about, okay, now you can go down and download, you know, now you can get the downloader and log in. And then it talks about, it's going to immediately throw you to go buy something and then it install. Which I'm like, okay, well, wait a second. Am I creating the account and the whole pieces to it? But if I have to buy something to do the free fly, isn't that like... That's so the right in front of us. See the red from the flares. Yeah, and most of the reason my question in this base here is I'd like to get everything installed so it doesn't like start and then it's like, oh yeah, because you said it's like 80 gigs where you then spend yeah. two hours waiting for the thing to download, then unpack and install and do it. It's like, okay, great. Well, you know. Hey guys, keep running around. I got another three and a half, four hours of dicking around with this thing, and gee, time I can play today is gone. Yeah. Because <laughs> you're just sitting there watching a progress bar, marching yeah. across the screen. Wow, look at that. That cat is laid across that ridge. Yep. But the last landing zone sucked. <laughs> yeah. That's the very nose of the ship. Right there. I've got it in third person view, so we're looking over the top of the ship. There's going to be your ingress into the into this section. You have to go up that little ridge line and jump onto that platform to get inside. More than likely, this is Yella or Walla. Walla. I think there's a little light gravity, so that helps. Yep. More debris. So I see, I see a box in, or a radar return indicator box. 
and then but actually right in the nose there yeah I see it right there right there yeah yep. I think I see a box there too there is a box there yes there is a loot crate that's now dancing because we both shot it oops always gotta shoot shit <laughs> You, you know, like you, you default yeah. behavior. What do you want? Yeah, I'm kind of. Su I'm surprised that one's sitting right there and not in that section right there that you got. Well, now that you shot it, it's not a problem. <laughs> it's probably destroyed whatever's inside it. <laughs> you can get in there. Hmm. This says fresh fruit. Why does it look singed? The one that was over here disappeared, but it was in that rear rear section. Okay. So it looks like landing. We land directly at uh, head right there. Yeah, I think the best bit is right over here. Switch to exterior so I'm gonna have a good look. Or based on how far you have me off, I could probably just step out of the turret onto the ground. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Clear. Very low gravity. All right, we are down. You, guys, you boys want to go out and look around in an all stay cab? Exiting ship, let's go see what kind of trouble we can get into, which is not very difficult for this group. <laughs> Tim, I'm trying to blow up half the ship before I get there. I want to see the. I said ship. I want to see these strip mines before. If I recall, you guys are the ones who keep blowing shit up. <laughs> I shot something. I didn't blow anything up. There is a difference. All right, this way. Okay. Except, Tony, when you tend to shoot things, there's kind of this root culprit that it takes place in. And? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I believe the entrance is over to the right here. Wow. Yeah, there is light gravity. There was originally a box symbol for that rear section. Okay. How you doing, Tim? I'm just looking around to make sure we're not missing anything. The good news is the trip lines are very obvious. Just, just uh, if you've got a... Uh, oh, you mean like those right there? <laughs> Ounce on one. <laughs> wow. I also watched two streamers walk through them with no damage, so... But I don't really want to test that theory. No, <laughs> neither do I. Can you get a... Can, uh, can you disarm them? You As I understand it, this is a trip item at this point. That appears to have done it. Yeah, I was able to cut the, cut the corner enough to actually shoot the mine. Except I think I also dented whatever light we had in here. Yes, you did. How do I turn on my light? T. There we are. Yeah, the mines there were up in these corners here. Yeah. There and a Connie. Is a Connie coming in? Yep. There's 
lay out of it. I gotta remember the damn layout of a cat. You're the piss out of me. I looked down and all of a sudden I saw a shit marker and I'm like, oh shit, that was quick. <laughs> Champagne Slim. Sounds like a player. Well, yeah, it is a player. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nothing here? Nothing here. I'm trying to get through these doors, but they're borked. Yep. How destructive is the environment? Can you start, you know, blowing holes and things? Or no, it's not quite that good. Or as far as uh, they haven't okay. implemented that level of destructive environment. I actually have a video that I just took today of a uh, security constellation, big ship, bouncing off the hull of the space station. Okay, guys, come. Guy has a gun in his hand. You said somebody's coming in, coming in after us. Is that what you're saying? Well, no. He looks like he started back towards the ship. Yeah, he went back to his ship. Can we get through that door in any way? Not that I can tell. That's truly being an asshole right there. Yeah, it is. Dora's got, you know, the quarter open. <laughs> yep. Yeah, all right, back down this way. Well, this is smacks of you have rat and cheese. Yeah. Very much. I think he didn't realize how poorly he landed his ship and can't get in his ship. Well, that's bad. Oopsie. Oh no, he got he got in the cargo bay. Yeah, thankfully, Connie does have that extra access bit. You said there was a theoretically a box somewhere around here. Um. Yeah, there. Were, well, originally there was there was a box marker in that rear section. There's one. The front of the red site. Too. Ooh, what is? Oh, this ought to be fun. There is a I side cargo opening. boxes. What's that, Tim? I said giant cargo boxes in this section. Flight recorder, do not open. Which means you're going to open it, right? I can grab it. I'm not going to at this point, but I can grab that. I know that there are some missions that want you to bring back the flight recorder so they can figure out what the hell happened. We don't have that mission. No, we do not. So let's not mess up somebody else's. Yep. Uh, well, you should pick it up and move it just to fuck with them. Oh, look, there's the Connie. I see it. I'm right behind him, so if he tries anything, he's... A toaster cookie? Yes. Finding no way to get up top. Connie has landed. This section is fucked. Yeah, I can't get further into this section either. I'm still, I walked around the back of the, uh, the section we were into. Uh huh. Nothing back there. Okay, where's the Connie? I wonder if he's looking for that box. He could very well be. Oh, wow. Oh, Those aren't big cargo containers. And on someone else who's already on the site, though. Alright, I'm going to start walking towards the other contain the other sections of the ship. Now, how hard is it to talk to another player like that when they show up? Technically, you can, in, you can, I believe, directly 
request communication with them on an audio channel. Someone did that yesterday to me. Yeah, there's a there's an in-game mechanism for doing audio channels. We have it turned off because it really gets annoying fast. Because there's sometimes yeah. that people just open broadcast, and oh my god, it won't just it's annoying. It's, I'm pretty sure just how many times. Go ahead. People don't understand that there's a mute button or a push to talk button. Yeah. yeah. I just leave the shit open. Now the question is, can you jump to get into that sideways door? <laughs> uh, I don't think so. But I think you might be able to pull yourself up with the tractor beam tool. No, the gravity, while it's light gravity, it's still okay. gravity. Uh, All right, the box that Jesse and I shot with the ship guns, I have arrived at, and it's got a set of armor arms. <laughs> Venture Armor Olive. I'm going to bring it along. I can't. It's too big. Oh, you will have to um, put the box into the back of the ship. When you, when you come around, you can tractor it into the back Ooh, of the ship. There's a body. Where's a body? A body in this part of the ship. All right, so let me actually equip a tractor beam. Venture Arms Olive. Venture Legs Olive. Search your rescue Search. But there appears to only be an adventure undersuit olive black. But I'm not getting a register on an actual center on a core armor piece. So he's just got the undersuit and the arms and the legs. I don't think I've had not, practice dragging shit around with this tractor beam for days. And, and, and I don't think any of that is worth our time. And I can't get for any further into the ship. I believe... Jump up there. Yep, come there. Maybe... I believe the box is in the ship. Yes. Yep, I see it. Okay. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Uh, Connie's taken off. He must have gotten his box. All right, Tim, which way did you get in this thing? Far end from where we hit it, and um, from where you come up to it, and you have to jump over to the sideways door and then just walk in. And It's interesting. We've got like storage boxes that have the ability to open the storage box shelf, but it doesn't actually. Oh, thank you for the light. Does that help? But there's nothing yeah. in them. Where? As far as I can tell. Okay, I'm at the body. Where did you go next, Tim? Straight up. I'm looking at you. Hi there. How do? None of these boxes are active. Damn, he's quick. I'm like, okay, I'm going to pick my path up, and then all of a sudden Tony's way above me. <laughs> <laughs> I have done the mine thing a lot in this game, and it sucks, but you learn how to walk around.
Not seeing anything up here of value. Nope. The only thing I haven't done is gone in that section of the ship over there. Oh, hey, I overshot. Yeah, but did you, <laughs> did you die or get hurt? No, that's just low gravity. I just overshot and kept going. Okay, let's go see what the other part of that ship looks like. I put the loot crate that we found in the ship already. Hey. Front of the front of that section is open too. Yeah, I can see you, Jess. I, I, I realized that after <laughs> I got a little lower. That sucks. The empty racks are active, but the full racks are not. <laughs> Assholes. Oh shit! There's a loot crate in there. Damn it! Did you go up? I went up. And then fell into something, and then I was standing on the loot crate, and I only noticed it as I was falling out the door. Yeah, right below your feet. That is not an active loot crate. All right, it just looked like one then, bastards. Yeah, no, it did. I, I saw it, and I'm like, oh, hey, yeah, no. Not letting me do anything. Look at something over here. I've got a box indicator of 240 meters over here. And he's in a ship and we have to run. Well, you know, we can jump, really. Box on the ground. It's running away. What the hell? The box is running away? box was sliding. Oh, you know what probably happened? The downdraft from the ship probably. Yeah, uh -huh. can you not blow it further away? Or maybe go the other side and blow it closer to us? <laughs> and, and, and are you sure it's a new box and not, did it, you know, the box that I put in the back of the ship fall out? Because there's yeah, no, no cargo grid in that bird. Because I, clo I closed the, the rear door of the ship. Okay. Or are we chasing Tupperware out of our own refrigerator? Well, that's entirely possible, too. That would be funny. All right, we're coming over the hill to you. We're 70 meters away. I see the box. Go get it, Tim. You're in front of me. What does it have? It has nothing in it. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> this is perfect for our day. Pretty much, yeah. Pretty flipping much. There's an admin. There's an admin. You know who's watching this and laughing his ass off because watch, 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 watch. I'm sure to some extent there is. So were there only were were the uh, Rex only supposed to be cats? I thought there were supposed to be other things like Connies and, and Starfarers. Um, the first ones might only be cats. I'm not entirely sure. True. Okay, let's see here. You can go to Lyria next and take a look. Okay, let's see. Loot. Hold on. What, is empty now? Might be empty once you move it a certain distance from where it was. There is that possibility because it now shows as empty. Well, that's annoying. That is annoying. I'm not going back to grab that armor because that was just worthless. Yeah, I, I don't disagree with that. Let me just get the thing off the ship because our luck, it will do something dumb. Like explode? Yeah. Yeah. All right, just for argument's sake, I'm going to check it while it's on the ground out here, make sure it's not empty. Because now <laughs> it's off the ship, you know dumb things happen. Mm-hmm. Nope, still empty. Okay, walking away. What was it? Uh, Venture Core Arms, olive color. You know the safety stuff. Door closing. I'm seated, by the way.
I am seated also. Okay, Mr. Bus Driver or Tour Driver, however you want to call yourself today, where are we going next? Going to Liria. Okay. Oh, God. Did I, I had to step away for a second. Did Mark get all of his questions answered about what to do before the free fly? Uh, or are we still not sure? No. Oh. I don't recall. I didn't bother with the free fly, so. Yeah, I know. All in, baby. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. One of my co-workers this morning texted me to check on me and said, you know, are, are you still really sick? And I texted back that my new pistol arrived at the, uh, at the gun shop at 11 a.m. on Friday, and it's still sitting there. And they were like, oh, my <laughs> God. You are sick. <laughs> This is serious. Yeah, no <laughs> shit. Uh, that's hilarious. Alright, where is L5? Okay, that's better. Is this a low gravity moon? Um, no clue. Just curious. Yeah, we're... I'm still playing with some of the settings, Mark, because we did a, they did a patch this week and screwed up a bunch of things as far as your settings Even go. improved it. Something Even like improved. that, yes. They, they call it improvement. I call it annoying. So I've had to reconfigure or, or reset a lot of my preferred defaults. What was that Microsoft called it? Undocumented user features? Yeah. <laughs> Undocumented enhancements. Undocumented quality of life enhancements. <laughs> You just shot that uh, my that uh, tripwire with a uh, standard rifle, right? Yeah, I use my custodian. Okay. Oh my god, that's the same guy right there. What? Oh, the same Connie? Uh-huh. Or is he just going to follow you in? Probably you want to go things. pick a different system? <laughs> Or he's already been and gone. Well, yeah, he's in a flying. And if he got there, he did, he did it pretty quick. I mean, if he Why don't we take one of those since we know what we're looking for? Sure, let me see if I can find some that are in the same general area we're at. Because, yeah, the Zeta Prolamide, however, that's some of the stuff that gets fussy. Oh. We're on Lyria. We're, we're on Lyria, right? Jesse, we're on Lyria. Yes. Okay. All right. We now have a mission to the to a wreck site on Lyria. That just went away. What? 
No, 150. I see. I see the pickup point. 159.4. That is probably what was in those active uh, rack containers. Yep. And somebody already got it. Just before we go too far here, um, does that mean we need a ship with a, a storage grid? I don't think so. No. Okay. If it's just a box, pick it a box. I just wanted to make sure before we got too far. Mm hmm. So is that uh, marker in the same general location as our pickup? Uh, negative. All right. All those fucking rocks. <laughs> Typical. What's this? Oh, that's just two 7,000 uh, size rocks with 80% Bexalite. That's all. <laughs> and the but you're not, because you're not mining today, we thought we'd be generous. <laughs> Are you guys not set up to mine today? Is that why you aren't just going over there and filling the thing yeah, up? We're not, we're not in mining vessels. When we're in mining vessels, we don't see a quarter of what you see popping up rock-wise on our screens. And it's not sensor issues because this mining ships have much better sensor suites. Mm -hmm. Basically, it's the game messing with us. Uh, we just chose to do this because yeah. it's a new, a new piece that got dropped, dropped in the game this week. You know, let's check out the new hot, if you will. Wait till salvage comes in in the next two quarters. Holy shit. That's going to get entertaining. Uh, we'll literally be carving up wrecks and pulling components out. Provided the ships that can do that are... I believe they, they're, they're, they're staggering the, the launch. They're going to give us the hand tool like we have a mining tool. We actually have a cutting torch. I'm wondering if they would have worked in those doors. Um... I but brought one with me. We can try on the next wreck. Sure. Uh, but yeah, they're going to give us a hand salvage tool. And then the vulture is the first up. Although the redeemer is already in game. I just don't know if it's going to get the functional pass it needs to be useful. No, I don't think it is. Versus just squishing things as it lands on them. That is a behemoth of a ship. Uh, flip us. Are we supposed to have a wreck out here? Yeah, I'm supposed to. I think it's to check the distance from the uh, start point. Is there a reason I'm upside down? Yeah, I just told you why I did it. I didn't hear. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm flipping us so I can get a distance reading from our starting point. Okay. And yeah, we missed it. Interesting. Okay. Was so the idea then when this with the salvage of, of ships, is it just for the raw materials out of the ship, or is it for specific components, or both? Both. Should be both. Yeah, yeah, should be both, yeah. There's armor plating and materials, that kind of stuff, and then there'll be components like, you know, shield generators and quantum drives and crap like that. We're not sure about how it's going to be implemented just yet, but there's also a later part of the loop where you can actually refurbish, up upgrade, or overclock, if you will, 
those components as well as weapon systems. Are we looking for flares and stuff? Yeah. Um, it's supposed to be we we overshot by at least twenty five clicks. So I'm getting back towards uh, uh, cell five to. I just wanted to make sure I was looking for those. Yeah, should be should be flares like last time. In other words, you could salvage stuff and uh, and up armor your own ship with it. Depending, yeah. Uh, some of the uh, some of the larger freighters and, and other strange ships like Starfires have really big weapon systems on them. Oh well, yeah, I mean I can imagine you're not gonna you know you know, the equivalent yep, of you're right, Jess. battleship gun. There, uh, that? you know. Orbit right. Oh, got it. Got it. Well, this one spread itself all over the place, but at least it's generally a flat area. Although that's a lot of fire in between those two components. Yeah, we'll we'll look to stay out of that. Yeah. Well, it looks a little chilly outside. You could warm yourself up. And you guys, you guys see the box indicators? I see it. Try not to shoot it this time, or blow it halfway across the map. Picky, uh, picky. Uh, Park over here. Of course, somebody shooting. <laughs> I didn't shoot at it. I shot a rock. Here we are down. I'm going to drop the ramp for you from the cockpit. I'm already there. Damn it, no beer. <laughs> of course, the entry is around the other side near the fire. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. Of course, that's just how this works. And no entry. You want to try cutting in? Yeah, let me get that out. I'm going to look at the other module real quick. But that's the one that's got the box in it. And that bit is not in this armor. God damn it, so no, I don't have that. All right, no big deal. Let's... Okay, that isn't going to work. Well, the thing is, is I thought ahead with the other set of armor, and then I was just trying to work within the limitations of what we have now. I got you. Hello. Here we go. Uh huh. Going over to that other box, Tim, or trying to get into that section of. Oh, sheep shit. Ah. Walk into a line? No, um, just lots of crap. So I'm going to try and bring the whole box with us. Okay, not that toy. That one. Oh, there's full shelves in here, but this isn't our mission, huh? <laughs> no. I go the wrong way. I went the no. Yeah, I went the wrong. Yeah, way. yeah. Go the other oh, direction. Okay, I'm gonna oh, set trip mines. You found trip mines. Good luck. Okay, all well, crap stayed. 
It looks like there it. might be a way into this from the top, and that's why I'm seeing the trip mines. Okay, where is the ship? Next to you. I just landed. Okay. Maybe loot it and store it in the ship inventory this time instead of just dropping the box. Yes. That'd be great. Let's see if I can do that now. And it's empty. About the next time you find it, just loot the fucking thing. <laughs> the hell? This is stupid. I don't recall that loot boxes were ever supposed to be movable like that. That's interesting. I'm, I'd am i almost be tempted to file a bug on this one. Because that doesn't make sense. If I pick up a container, it yeah. should... You know, the container should be there. That's interesting. We didn't lose much. It was a bunch of fruit, a grenade, a utility tool, and uh, a mag of something. On your six, Tim. Okay. Stuck by a pole. You'd use that box to trigger the trip lines, too. Empty box. I was trying to get into a better way to... I'll say from here, if you just shoot that center one, it might clear them both out. But is the sensor down here, up there, or at the bottom? I don't know. I can't tell. Uh, look at the sensors at the bottom. Yeah. So I don't think shooting it will do anything, but we're going to try What I was trying to do is get into that area right there. Okay. There's this little side ramp area, and I was hoping to get in there and be able to hit the mines from there. Well, I'm bringing us a Trojan horse. Okay. You have your uh, tractor tool handy? That I believe I did bring. Okay. There's your there's your object to throw through the the uh, mines. But they have to swap it out. Should be able to f, f and customize it, and then be able to put the piece on you want. Got it. I have no idea how to use this, but let's have some fun. How do we bring it towards me? Scroll back. And now... Oh, no. It just went right through. Uh, I don't see any, oh I see what Jesus I could uh, pick it back up and move it more on through. it um, the trick now because of where it fell is doing that without actually tripping the mines yeah. <laughs> it's like operations with explosions mm-hmm they feel a little <laughs> And the box is still intact. There's at least but, um, one more tripwire up here, so that's good. Let's say loot, loot the, loot the items out of the box, and then um, use the tractor tool to 
the empty box that I was using. Oh, okay. But oh. any loot crate you find, are, you know, yep. rather than moving Maybe. it and have port causing the shit to despawn. There was at least one more over here, Tony, so be careful. Yes, I'm looking around. In the wreck I was in earlier, there was a hatch in the hole, and I went up to the edge of the hole to look, almost stepped over the edge, and there were there were two trip, trip lines under at the bottom of that. <laughs> but be very, very careful. Yeah, yeah, moving, moving crates, bad idea. There they are. You're right next to them, Tony. Congratulations. <laughs> uh, let me see if I can. Can you get that box? I can't see the box. I am working here. on it. Hey, Loot Crate. Great, now I'm stuck. I'm now on top of the ship. Yeah, what? Just watch oh, the I got the loot crate, so I'm grabbing shit out of it. <laughs> that was funny. Oh, I'm dying. Oh, I'm gonna. Great. Okay. Apparently, I didn't get my. I am incapacitated. I'm trying to get over there. That's fine. Take your time. I've got an hour and a half. Is there at least anything interesting in the loot crate? Uh, yeah, I'll tell you in a minute. There was a helmet and some sights and a grenade. I just grabbed everything. Cool. I had to swap out parts on my multi-tool. Why is it not coming up and staying in my hand? If you have a med gun and you hold two, it should, you should be able, to be able to select the med gun. No, apparently I didn't do that either. Okay. I think to swap functions, you have it's to... Just not, it's just not going into my hand. Okay. What's in your hands? Nothing? Or the crate? Or Nothing. Uh, hold down two and see if that works, or have you tried that? I just had to put it in my inventory because I couldn't. Yeah, every time I put I just manually put it into my hand. Yeah. And it, like, automatically restored itself. Oh, we're having one of those days. Yes. Mr. Wolf? Is? You may need to park and come in here. I don't know what the deal is, but I cannot get this to stay in my hand.
on, really? Air proper. Oh, no idea. I mean, there's one on my hip. <laughs> I have one on my hip now, too. So, in answer to your question, one Mark IV grenade, one GP33 uh, magazine, a G2 helmet violet. Oh, did you get me res there? PT3 and an RF1. Gotcha. Holy crap. The hell did you do? Uh, well, I clipped through the damn ship, which doesn't help anything. And then fell, trying to get down, trying to get back in to get that box up to you. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Originally, that box, before it did something stupid, had... Um, Can you look around to see if there's a multi-tool in there somewhere? Because I'm not seeing my multi-tool on my inventory anywhere. Wait. Looking around. Or looking outside the ship under it. Except it's flat on the ground, so that doesn't help. Oh. I mean, it's not a big deal. It just no, it's just, yeah, it's, per, it's a principal thing here. Like, what the hell? Yep. <laughs> Yeah, I see grabbed, it anywhere. Grabbed the box that was on the ground out here already. I hadn't gotten to that one yet. Where is it? I did already. Oh, was there anything in it? Uh, there's a set of arms that I that I grabbed. There's also okay. a grenade. I already I equipped the grenade and grabbed the. Uh, um. So, Tim. Arms. Yeah. You left one mine intact, right? One trip mine? Yeah, there's still a trip mine intact. That okay. was where I was going next, but it doesn't really matter. We got to the other side of it. Yeah, no, I, I went to the front end of the, the cat and was able to get in that way. I could see the trip yep. mine, but I couldn't do much else. What's down here? Nope. Whoever's watching on the stream is probably going, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> you know, standard it's FPS like stuff. Watching drunk. It's like walking, watching Drunken Sailor. It's just... <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is the front half of the cat, right? <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to walk to the other end of the cat and see if there's anything interesting. Hopefully without dying. another ship up? Oh, Jesse's up. Okay. Like, suddenly lights were coming on. I'm like, um... <laughs> Wander boots. On that light, the dead body? Yep. Have you already been in this one? I believe I've been in it, but I didn't really see much, and I didn't couldn't get the boots off the guy if I tried. Okay, here we go again. I have the boots. Cool. I don't know if they want them. Just was. Uh, <laughs> I, I I don't know why. Other than I just I was like, oh well. Okay, that's fucked up. Jesse, are you watching the stream? Um, I can't watch the stream stream because I'm using my computer. Okay. Me alt tab. 
there's a, a section in here that goes light, dark, light, dark, and I'm not doing much except turning. I'm looking at the stream. <laughs> nice. I'm gonna call that some interactivity issues. I think. Probably because of the big honk and starship searchlight coming through there. Oh look, the toilets are intact. Oh, that's always good. <laughs> And I don't think there's any further I can go in this end of it. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, there's still power at this end. That's interesting. Yeah, I thought so too. I was able to open a door. Indoor, um... That just gets spooky on something like a caterpillar. Work lights. I'd love to take the work light with me, but that's good. Any box indicators on this end of the ship, Jess? Uh, negative. Okay, so we're just. Futzing around then. What the hell am I standing on? Yeah, see, these work lights would be handy. <laughs> Fuckers. Trigger a trip line? No. It just would be, they're very bright. Yeah. This must have been ship noise that I heard then. I don't think there's anything at the back of the cats that you can do. No, but there for some reason looks like a ramp. That's why I'm going to go check it out. You know, they always... Holes in the top. No, this isn't what I think it is, is it? Nope, okay, can't walk on it. Yeah, to me, that looks like a ramp if you've seen what I'm seeing, Tim. Yep. But I couldn't stand on it, so. I think that's the end of the cat. Oh, then there's that. Is that what you're talking about, Jess? This big side door? Um, I don't know. Was I talking about a side door? <laughs> yes, I see that. Question is, you can't jump to it, but if we disembarked on the top from a ramp, we might be able to drop in on that. Or you can get on the, or you can get on the ramp and then just be dropped right directly onto yeah, it, can, right? They can drop you off on it. Can you pull yourself to it, Tony? No, it wouldn't let me. Magic. Okay, I'm Coming gonna knock the back ramp of the ship. This ought to be dangerous. Yep. And then again. All recorded for posterity. You want to go to the top of the ramp? Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, let's see what we can do about uh, walking you in here. Okay. All right. I'd say up about 10 meters and back left about I'm, 2 degrees. I'm external too, so I'm kind of want to get perpendicular first. He's such a perfectionist. Yeah, I know. 
Especially when we really find out that there's trip mines in there that we can't see currently. Right. Just remember to yell Geronimo when you jump. Yeah. <laughs> or not a good Tarzan yell. Actually, what's really funny is, is ideally we won't jump at all. We'll just walk. <laughs> Trying to eventually, what you're trying to do here is what the old World War II airborne called a, a tailgate jump. Yep. Yep. Actually, it's more like that that Chinook pilot who yeah. dropped his ramp on the roof of a building on the side of a cliff. Yep. Yep. I'm gonna transit right just a bit. Yeah. There we go. And stop. Won't translate right anymore. Well, I guess not. Go back a skosh. And again, more power up here. Stop. All right, we're both in. Yep, I'm just gonna keep it parked right there. Well, A, there's a loot crate. B, there's a trip mine. And C, they're not in the same location. <laughs> Always good. What's in the loot crate? No, I haven't looked yet. I shall take care of that. Oh, look, Tim, just for you. I will step out of it so you can look. The wheat! <laughs> Tim has a thing with purple armor. What did you find? Link's, uh, Link's arms. Okay. In violent purple. <laughs> oh, that's why there's a trip mine. Shit. Why is there a trip mine? It goes down. Okay. So as soon as you empty this out, we're going to use the trip mine. We're going to use the box to blow up the trip mine. Uh, as soon as I can figure out, I can't store the arms. It can't store it, but you can, you, if you grab, grab, it, drop it, grab it, and boxes. if you want to do, well. Just, I'll, I'll pull whatever's left once you get the arms moved. Can I just grab it and drop it? Yeah. Yeah. It'll come out like a box we you know, all the boxes we find on the, on the streets of Area 18. Not letting me grab it. Is there something in my hands? No, I don't see anything physically in your hand. Yeah, it's. Can you see if you can do it? Yeah, For whatever fine. reason, I can't. Tim, how much you want to bet the reason why you can't find your multi tool is because it's bugged and it actually yep. thinks it's in your hand? There you go, Tim. Probably. You can grab that crate, can't you, Tim? Should be able to. Are we going to leave the PA4? No, I'll grab it in a second here. I've got room for one more weapon on my back. Okay. Got it. I'm going to go store it in the ship. Okay, I'm gonna come. Ship's there. Okay, I'm gonna come and store this back on the ship. Where'd the ship go? It's still here. Yeah, give me a second. Let me get on board. I guess they don't have to manually hold this hover. <laughs> okay, back we go. Oh! 
as Tim jumps onto the top of the ship. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, 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 I took screenshots of that whole sequence. <laughs> the outside. It was awesome. Okay. I was like, okay, I'll just need a, a little Don't, bump. Okay, stay over there. Yep. Oh, there's a second one. No, I got it. Oh, okay, now I'm in the uh, lower cab of the main ship. With a loot crate. Let's see, make sure it's not the same. It's the same loot crate? Yeah, it's the same loot crate. Let's see if there's anything else worth it. Right. But, on the flip side, I can actually leave now. Without having to get back on the ship or climb back up. I don't recall seeing that entrance before. Did you open the door? Which entrance? That side door right there. It was open. You couldn't jump to it. Okay. I cannot sit in the seats. Okay. I'm very disappointed. It's nasty Russian leftovers. What do you want? <laughs> All right, I'm headed back to the ship. All right, I'm going to exit this way since I don't feel like climbing back up. Did you notice the little side entrance down, Tony? There's another loot crate in here. Really? I didn't see uh, that one. Yeah. Oh, a grenade. A multi-tool. <laughs> uh, a tractor beam. <laughs> an Adrena pen. A detox pen. So yellow and orange? Or orange and gray? And Optipen, so I have uh, uh, purple, green, and a kind of a gray. And gotcha. then uh, revenant pods and Dakari pods. Those are only useful for tripping through lines. Pretty much. Actually, grab take a look at this fruit real quick. Just to, okay. there's, there's certain effects on them. Some are hydrating and energizing, some are toxic. Um, now the Dakari pods have to be processed as, before they can be a food source. Okay. It's interesting that your view, Tony, shows the ship all going a little bit. Yeah, well, you know, desync. It's a thing. Mm hmm It is. And the other ones are collected, also have to be processed for something. All right. No, never mind. But they, they might be valuable as um, they might be valuable as other stuff, but not for anything that we're going to bother with. Right. So, all right. I am no. in the ship. So, and if you want to come forward and land, I'll get back on the ship. No. I am to your uh, nine o'clock, Jess. Can we actually put anything in the gun racks? You can. I just think it would be neat if we stored the spare weapons in those. Right. I'll take the PA4 since I shoved it in the inventory and put it in the gun rack. Where's the gun rack? Is it upstairs? Wardrobe. Or, gun rack is upstairs. Okay. Unless there's one down there. No. By the way, high kudos to the pilot for maintaining position. Yes, that was very well done. <laughs> and huzzah, we have a PA4 in the gun racks. Nice! Alright, I am sitting. I'm not in a turret, but I am sitting. Do we want to go do our mission now? Probably. Because that was an eleven thousand dollar payout. I did. I did share it out. Let me share it again. Sharing. Accepted. Okay.
That's interesting. Why does it still think I have the damn gun in my hands? While we're flying, I'm going to go buy it. Here's what did that. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll give them credit. They, they, they set the things up nicely to uh, get you involved in going into those things. Although I didn't see any uh, NPCs this time, so that was interesting. And by me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> your your little Pisces is still a smoking ruin someplace. Yep. There's a hole in the ground. Oh man. Around three thirty Facebook should be blowing up with a bunch of our fraternity brothers just screaming about the game in one way, shape, or form. And yes, Tim, it's a sports ball kind of thing that your uh, sports book is probably being very busy with right now. It's by the way, Oh, that's right. I'm pretty sure all the sports books last weekend were losing shit. Cause yep. <sighs> the Niners beat, was it two weeks in a row they beat the spread? As well as one when they shouldn't have? Well, the spread is the spread is for the team supposed to win, right? But they still the fact that they won was messed everything up completely. <laughs> well, and most of them, their spread has only been by like three, like three and a half points. So right. was it last weekend sixteen though? Um, Which is sad that they're actually showing that now on NFL.com. No, I don't think it's like no. The spreads for both for both. I mean, three and a half is basically even. Okay. Anyway, it just means as long as one team wins, but it's essentially if the other team then wins by a field goal, then you know the point. The points don't essentially they uh, they go through things with me like that. Point piece to it is as long as Dallas won by a field goal, then they covered the spread. Right. But I mean, it's there's all kinds of pieces. I mean, they have, I mean, they have all. I mean, with, especially with football, they have, you know, what was the score at the end of each quarter? Who scores first? Uh, you know, the the actual score of the game. You know, the win loss. There's these guys. I mean, they they created so many avenues that you could bet on. It's, I mean, it's just like good grief. They've gotten, you know, they've just gotten so sophisticated with how, how they different bet on. Well, then you can go through the same thing where you can go online and just be doing bets. Um, almost near real time. Yeah. Where you almost, you know, like, like micro bets. Of, okay, then, you know, this team now has the ball, you know. You can throw down money on whether or not they're going to, you know, they're going to score a touchdown and these, you know, different aspects where you can start throwing money against. <laughs> it's just like, good grief. About to set down on this one. I have no idea where we're at. <laughs> Whoa! Um. Jess, what was that? That was a little, uh, had the throttle up too high still. <laughs> Never been happier to be in a turret. <laughs> I was just sitting in a chair. I felt like a ping pong ball. Did you dent the ship again? Maybe. Uh, um, you've got a rock to your back right. It's the left scissor hung on that. 
you go forward a tiny bit, you should clear it. Yep. I was going to say, check Jesse to see if he's wearing Mickey Mouse hair hats and giving a ride to Disneyland. Well, was that what that meant on his his resume? It's it's not a box truck, so obviously it's not going to be for the new uh, hotel. Yes. <laughs> All right, we're, we're down. All right, let's go uh, rescue the Zeta Prolamide. What a what a way! <laughs> if you look at the top of my screen, I don't know if you can Bless read. You. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm sorry. I even said it wrong. Prolanide, not mide. Well, we yeah. don't want to offend it. <laughs> we have to pick up this cargo that's been left behind, bring it back to, I guess, Area 18? No, I'm, I'm checking right now. We have to go to uh, Damson and Sons Salvage Center on Walla. Okay. That's cool. That's actually at least a neat something neat to do, look at. The question is, what the yeah, fuck? It almost sounds like Sanford and Son. Not expected. Oh, they're, 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 yeah, we have Tamney and Sons. We have all sorts of strange crap. Here's one entry. they got to have Red Fox walk out and start just being snarky. <laughs> Here we are. What kills me is those are shows that if you think about it, I mean, with everything you go, Archie Bunker, the Jeffersons. Yeah, they Stanford couldn't be made today. Done. You oh, couldn't no. make those things today. No. Uh, Tim, is this it? No, this isn't it. Never mind. Side entrance open. I'm on your six. Hey, Tim, so here's the question for you. So when Tony says that, you know he has a firearm in his hand. Is that reassuring or scary? I found a loot crate. <sighs> All right, I'll leave that to you. It's got some uh, med pens in it, a grenade, and a multi-tool, and a tractor beam, and a bunch of things I don't want to pick up. I was going to say, pick them up and put them in the ship. These are slime molds. We have a, uh, and another ship. Another ship landing. But he's landing, so I'm not really going to be concerned. Oh, pick up packages distant, 68 meters distant. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shit. Yeah. Oh, what was that? I thought it was a trip mine. It's just the glow from under the door frame. He might be doing the same mi mission because he just probably went is. The rear section. It has it has a package marker. Yep, I am grabbing packages as we speak. Okay. Where did his ship go? We can do this through uh, with the multi tools. If you want. Where the fuck is Jesse? Oh, we need to put things in the ship, dude. In the ground. Fight. Okay, we're gonna get the other ones. We have to get four of them, if I recall correctly. Yeah, and I'm getting a second piece that's 95 meters away to pick up the package, so I don't know what that is. Well, let's pick up these four and then go from there. Yes. Seriously? 
Let's keep an eye on the dude. All right. And they're starting to slide downhill. All right, so where is Jesse? In the air. Now he's another, coming down. Got one other package at the uh, far end where the guy had started to go in. Oh, right. Okay, can you just land? Because I think you just blew that package right. partially away. Yeah, I see three of these with markers on them. Two, one doesn't. So I don't know what this guy's doing here. All right, you want me to grab the other package while we're waiting for him to land? Uh, there's one in my hand, and there's three on the ground. Right, and there's one more and 118 meters away. Let me just set this down. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to walk them all over there. This ought to be fun. Jess, check the mission log on this one. I think all we have to pick up is what you have there. Unless we just need to pick up a one from each location. Uh, no, there's there's supposed to be four markers in the, the, in the mission guys, log. The other guy's yep. running one into the ship right now. That's fine. That's awful nice of him. And they're the same out. thing. Yeah. Your mission log should have updated, Jess. Do you see one or two? Um, I see three fulfilled, so just put the last package on and we will be done. And I'll just leave these three here. Okay, I've got three on the deck in the ship. Need one more. Need one more. Okay, this guy's got to get the one more. And where is his ship? I have no idea. Oh, it despawned, okay. Yeah, despawned on. So are we giving him a ride back too? Yeah. Okay. Well, the, the other three are back here. Okay, we need mm -hmm. one more, one more Zeta Prolamide. It still shows we're missing one, so I think that's that one back there, yep. Tim. Okay. I got, I got it in hand. Okay. And then there's two more here, so all he has to do is grab these over here. So is he running the same mission, Jess? I don't know. I wasn't talking about it. Okay. He's impressed by the ship, though. <laughs> <laughs> Should have brought the Carrick and just completely overwhelmed him. Where the hell do I go next? Uh, good question. What do you want to do? <laughs> Yeah, he's probably going to need to grab however many he needs and throw them on the ship as well. Is he doing a mission? Well, he doesn't have a ship, so... Oh. Then we can just get going. Yeah. Everybody in? No. I'm uh, 140 off the ship. I'll be there in a second. Somebody check the mission log. I'm doing that now. 
Thank you. Yep. We, got no, we have to deliver them. Okay, just gonna deliver. Yep. On board. Whoops, wait a minute. No, I he's missed, not. I missed the ramp. <laughs> <laughs> I opened the door just to see you flying fast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do a splat against the, the side of the hole, I'll spread eagle. Uh, that's funny. Is the ramp closed? Or did closing the back door just close the back door? I can close it from the cockpit. Alright. Alright, let's go. Let's go visit Sanford and Sons. Because now you got that stuck in my head. Hmm. And you're playing the theme song too, aren't you? Uh huh. Dan 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 dan. Watch, watch, watching for the red Ford truck the whole bit. Yep. How the fuck did his ship despawn? It's happened before. Yes, yeah. but when you don't have anybody in it, there's a cl it's clock that starts going. But he wasn't there that long. No, sometimes it all all you do is you get up, you um, get out of the seat, exit the ship, and the thing disappears on you. If you die suddenly, we'll know what happened, and we'll come down and deal with it. <laughs> <laughs> Why he's trying to take... Well, I, I don't think he'd be that stupid considering he knows there's two other people on the ship and there are. You are dealing with somebody from the internet, you realize. <laughs> well, okay, that is true. The difference is, is if he kills Jesse, he pretty much is almost immediately going to get a crime stat, and then we'll, by the time we get out of our turrets... We can accept permission um, to kill him? Well, yeah, we'll have permission to kill him and get a boat uh, reward. So what you're really saying is, Jesse, provoke him <laughs> get killed so we can uh, benefit from your death. Sadly, we can't store these things in our backpacks. Yeah. He got lost getting to the second floor. <laughs> oh shit, it did the fucking... Uh... If you've never been on the ship before. True. It is definitely an experience getting on board and going, where the fuck do I go? That looks like a closet. Is that a closet? Oh, it's a ladder. Okay, keep going on the ladder. Ah, uh, shit, there's more doors up here. And one of them looks like the door to the uh, back ramp. Yeah. Uh, you said, oh, shit, Jesse. What's up? Thing uh, QT bug. Got it. I had the I had the wrong the wrong thing wrong uh, destination selected and it freaked out. <laughs> I was wondering why we were flying so far. Well, it's because the the quantum bug sends you off towards the sun.
Excuse me, sir, I'd like to complain my in-flight meal wasn't correct. <laughs> I was supposed to have the fish. <laughs> oh, right into the sun. I love it. What are we making from this? I don't know. I think it was more just to get to a wreck site. Oh, look at our huge one. 11 grand. Okay. We've had less, <laughs> less worthy paydays. <laughs> True. Seventy five percent. And cool. <laughs> Five rock bomb. Uh, <laughs> I'm just no longer commenting. <laughs> This is our drop-off point. Mm -hmm. Far side of it seems flat. I love these these things. Clear. Okay, so we've got specific drop off points inside the facility. Mm -hmm. Hey, Jess, can you let him know that if he tries to help, we don't get credit? Okay, hold on. Whoop, 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 dude, stop. Hey, Jess, can you open the back hatch? Got it. Okay. Okay, I'm going for the one that's 40 some odd meters away here. To me, it looks like the drop off points are all over the place. Yeah. Actually, I don't think they are. I think what you're seeing is the other boxes. Okay. Okay, that's one.
So effectively, we've just done one of the newer box missions. Basically. Yeah. I know there are newer box missions when you get further up the food chain that are 45 grand. I go out and take a look. Why can't I grab this box? Okay. Tim, do you still see a box on the ship? Yes, I do. Okay, because I couldn't grab that one. It's fine, I'll grab it. I have the technology, I think. We'll find out in a minute here, won't we? What's, the, what's this have on it? Galderines? Four Galderines and then a bunch of other repeaters. There are actually... Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's good. Yeah, four, four, four Galderines, size fives. Um, two Rhinos and then... A host of other things on the turrets. Oh, that's it. You are actually got one of the scissors on top of one of the Gatling guns on the ground. Oh, boy, the ship's kind of doing a little bouncy. Yeah. Okay, I believe Tim is about to finish the contract for us. Why is it not processing? Oh, well, no, you got the other one. Look at those three out of there. That was interesting. Did it take it? It it went into the, the bay, and I placed it in the bay. Right. And then it bounced around, and I had to reopen the bay. Okay. And... It. Okay, let's try that again. It, this particular box is being fussy. Okay. Okay. Complete. Okay, cool. Bells are size 5, right? The Galdrins are size 5. The Rhinos on the wings are size 4s. Everything else is size 3s. You might have M5As on one end and Panthers on the other. So four. I'll get the door. You rock. Ramp coming up. Going back to the turret. And now, where do we need to take our, our friend here? Okay, like that. See you. So, because I'm moving. Do you guys get any kind of a notice when I, if I when I use your account, like your 
referral account you get kind of like a notice or anything if I use it when I create my account? Yes, it'll tell us. There's two stages. It'll tell us, uh, I believe it's prospect, and the minute you buy in, it says something. Right. Okay. Tony, I, I can't, I think I, I'm not sure if I grab either Tony or Tony or Jesse's code, so. Um, just now we're chatting, let's make, sure we, let's make sure we get you Jesse's code. The way the referral bonuses work this time, it's not beneficial to me, but it is to him. Well, I already created a, I already created one account, and I'm not sure which one I used. Okay, I'll go find out. <laughs> I'll see if it was mine or not. Did he say where he yeah. needs to go, Jess? Um, I asked him if By Genie was was good, and he didn't reply. So we're going to By Genie, it is. <laughs> Whether he likes it or not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will tell you from this account setup now. I've got the account set up, and it basically says, "Okay, go to the game, Star Citizen." Basically, it's forcing you to buy a pack before it shows me anything where I can download anything. Gotcha. Uh, yeah. Yeah. What'll happen is it um, during IAE they'll loosen that up. They'll probably should they should loosen it up just before, and then you'll be able to apply a code to your account, and then you'll be able to start all that stuff. We'll stay on top of it to make sure that you get that information. Yeah, because what it's showing right now is the Mustang Alpha or the Aurora MR. Yeah. Okay, you must have used Jesse's. I don't show any new prospects. There you go. And people in chat are saying 30k possible. Because what Jesse needs is more armor. Oh, right? yeah. yeah. There it goes. Bloody 30k. Yep. This might be well, a good time to take a break. Matter. It <laughs> yeah, doesn't matter where he wanted to go. Yeah. <laughs> Not anymore. Yeah, good good break point because I need to go take care of laundry. Yep. Sounds like a plan. What's that? Break time.